I'm Finn Bankswell. Hello, my name is Kian. I'm the director, programmer, and designer, and I guess the visionary behind Lost. I worked on level design and art design. The original idea behind Lost was simple. Make a game that can be played not just by players who don't have any visual impairments, but by visually impaired gamers who might suffer from blindness. Although a lot of games can technically be learned by visually impaired gamers through contrived methods, we felt that it would be important to create an experience that was designed specifically to be played by players who wouldn't be able to experience gaming by visual traditional means. The way we achieved this was by having the player control a little robot character that is trying to navigate through a series of mazes but his display has been cut off, so he's unable to observe the space around him, and he has to rely on audio cues alone to make it to the end of each level. Sound design in Lost is obviously one of the most important things that we had to get right, because there's no visuals, there's nothing to tell you where to go. You need to be able to rely on the audio cues alone. The audio cues for different obstacles like walls, or force fields, or sinkholes, or any number of dangers that the robot might encounter on his journey are all unique. So the levels are designed on a 10 by 8 grid. We designed them initially in a photo editing app called GIMP. We just set up a grid and we put in different blocks of colours to represent different obstacles for each tile. Then created this very handy little tool which allowed us to key in a string of letters that all equated to a type of block. We could just basically type out the levels into scratch. It was as easy as that. One of the things that we realised a little while through Lost is that we needed another pair of eyes testing to ensure that the levels would be fair because we'd kind of be playing our levels for a while we've been getting used to the idea of moving around in this space using audio cues alone for navigation so we recruited a bunch of our classmates to help us with this and we just got them playing through levels 